All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, but before we get to the video, y'all see the shirt that I got on, I grind hard, because that's what I do, man, every day of my life. I grind hard, and you should, too. We putting out three videos today, man. Check it out. We got the I grind hard uh, short sleeve shirts. We got the uh, sleeveless shirts. We got the tank tops. We got pretty much everything, man. If you rock with Anonymous 2K TV and the assist game, we got the assist game where we even got the long sleeve shirt with the team working defense on the sleeve. If you vegan like I am, we have the... Uh, we got the uh, eat more veggies, not chicken. Uh, you know, if you're in your bag, if you like Quavo, Quavo, you in your bag. Hey, you get to do in your bag, baby. That's what it is. You're living your best life. Like Duvall, we just, it just says smile on the shirt that I'm going to send y'all. It's not going to say smile, bitch, so you can actually wear that out in public. But like I said, we got the grind gear. Uh, you know, I grind hard. I grind hard. It's a green. A lot of my sayings and stuff like that. It's a green. We got security bag. Uh, you know, and then my wife's t-shirt, she, she created, somebody, somebody bought this too, they actually liked it, she thought she could, so she did, I'm trying to get these out into this game trash, and uh, also my personal favorite shirt, the vegan strong, we, I do all these in house, and then I just send them out, man, I got my press, I got everything right here, man, I got all the stuff, um, some of the stuff, if it's words, it's heat press vinyl, this is heat press vinyl, right here, and then it's just got white back. And then on the on the white shirt, it's just straight up heat press vinyl because you know it, it is what it is. The graphics are also heat press, um, but they're a different type. It's like the, the heat press vinyl, printable heat press, press vinyl. If you want to know what that is, so you know yeah, if you're familiar with what that is, I just want to get that out there. Link is in the description. Go over there, cop some merch, support the support the movement. This is gonna be my year, man. Like I said, if I don't make it to 200,000 subs this year, it's a wrap for me. I'm not even gonna lie to you because I'm just completely wasting my time. I think my content is actually pretty decent, and uh, you know. They gonna have to, we gonna have to start, I'm gonna have to step my game up, so I'm gonna ask you guys to step your game up and like the video, if you like the video. But on with the video, man. If you are playing Lockdown Defender this year, come in to 2K University, AKA Lockdown University. Like I said, we're gonna get the LDU shirt so we can get it popping. You need to familiarize yourself with all these moves. We already know that box out has been revamped. We know how to box out left trigger. And uh, also what you can do with, with box out is not up here, but you can push right stick and left stick. I mean, right stick to the right or to the left. And you can, you see how he's moving so LeBron can't get around him. If somebody is around you and they're superior rebounder, you, you have to hold, you have to move the stick right into the left. A lot of that stuff is not here. Um, but it should be. Rebounding, we already know that's, that's triangle or Y. Uh, we're going to get to those three moves in a minute. Deny, hands out. Denying hands out, uh, we know that one, that's the only move that anybody ever uses when they when they lock people in the corner. We know the deny engage because they use that in tandem with deny hands out. Uh, you know, they, they just hold left trigger in the corner or left left bumper. I mean, left left stick. Left, uh, L1, L2 in the corner. Off ball foul. This is the bane of my existence. And I'm going to tell you why. We're going to get back to that in a second. Post engage. You, we should know how to post engage. If somebody try to post you up, you should know how to do this. Post push rarely works, but hey, if you're stronger than them, they say strength matters this year, you might. That's probably a defensive foul in the real league, but you know you hardly ever see that. Pull the chair, rarely ever works. But uh, oh, so now they got moved the right stick away. Uh, I think last year was moved the left stick away from the person. So this may actually work this year if you can actually get the direction right. Uh, transition, post transition. These are the things you got to familiarize yourself with. Use the right stick to get around the guy. It's a guessing game. A lot of times it's a guessing game, man. It's a gamble because if you guess wrong, they get a free dunk. But, hey, a lot of times with these guys, they're going to get a free dunk anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Post fight for position. You got to learn how to fight for position. You got to fight for your right to position. You got to fight for position, man. You got to got to do that if you can if you learn these two post transition fighting for position you fighting for position and you you sitting there you, you just straight up denying him fighting for position and you do that at the right time you can get that entry pass there so we segue right into that and uh you know post disengage we already know that and everybody knows die for the loose ball whether they meant to do it or not but the three things that you absolutely must learn how to do if you want to play better defense better post defense better perimeter defense better any defense man bump chuck and grab bump this year is simply whole l so everybody knows how to do that everybody knows how to ride but you don't always know what to do after you bump the guy after you bump the guy you want to grab him so you want to just tap the tap b in the direction that you should push him on out of the paint and when they try to re-enter the paint you chuck them and then you repeat the cycle and you do this as much as you can so that on offense they feel like they don't even have 
control of their player on offense. I used to do this all the time with my lockdown and just just completely just just make people ungodly mad. And, I, and like I said, I know I got a, I know I got a lot of my lockdowns in the chat, in the comments or whatever, man. Like I said, make sure y'all leave it like y'all get active or whatever. I know I know y'all probably mad because I'm, I'm putting this information out there and nobody ever goes in here and looks at any of it, but it needs to be out there, man. We got all these people with these short arms this year. We got people that don't know what they're doing. We want people to be to come into Lockdown University. If you come to Lockdown University, we want you to leave being great. We don't want you to leave and be mediocre. But uh, so this move is pretty easy. You can still bump. Chucking is pretty easy. You can do that. You know, you got to stand still and then just tap the button and move towards the offensive player. Just move in this path. This move has been the bane of my existence all morning. We're going to try to do it, but, um, all right, so let's go with Kevin Durant. Uh, let's go with Boogie. Let's see if I can do it. If I can. First of all, let's get, let's get, let's. It's, it's so hard to do because the computer doesn't, the computer don't, don't try to do nothing. But the computer doesn't try to do anything so there you go i was able to push him you see i was able to push him right there so you can do things like that let's see if i can push tristan thompson okay so there they, they, they let me do it they didn't call a foul so right here i'm just gonna straight up deny him do everything i want so you see how i'm just straight up denying him he can't get in he wants to but look at what happens if you miss if you ah uh, if you do it at the wrong time or you miss they're going if you miss they're gonna score. Otherwise, they're gonna call foul. It is extremely annoying, but you have to, this year, you, you can't just spam it. You have to let the offense, like, like I can't just run into him this year and do that. They're gonna call foul nine times out of 10. You can't just do it like you could last year. You could just spam it last year. This year, they ain't going for it. And uh, I'm gonna tell you why. Cause like, okay, so like last year, I could just straight up push him. Now I'm not, oh, get that out of here, boy. Get it out of here again. That's booking two blocks a game. Now you can't just spam it. And I guess that's a good thing. If you are a, uh, if you're a big man, and if you, if you, um, oh, get up. Woo, I don't know why they let me do that. But uh, let's go. Let me see if I can get Tristan. See, I'm gonna push him down the court. So I can straight up deny him and do all of that. But like I said, if you do it at the wrong time, they're gonna call foul. And I'm gonna show you why they're calling foul now. They're calling foul now because now you can foul away from the ball. This was never a thing in 2K, but now you can foul away from the ball. I definitely understand why it's there. I just don't know why it's so easy to do. Why would you put the foul away from the ball on the same button as me playing defense and flopping? So you're gonna see a lot of people flopping this year. You're gonna see a lot of people. I, I, I really hope that we can change, change that. I don't know if it's something that we can change, but I really wish that we could because I don't wanna use B. To initiate I'm gonna use the right stick and the left stick and that's that's just impeding all of our progress as uh, as lockdown defenders so if you're a lockdown defender you're probably gonna foul off the ball a lot you used to be able to terrorize people we used to be able to just sit there and straight run into people and uh, and do all types of stuff now just remember you can only do it if they're initiating it like right here Tristan will not cut why will he not cut man nobody's cutting and so it's so hard to show y'all get that out of here it's so hard to show y'all what i'm trying to show y'all but see i can bump him you see i just tried to bump him but it, it, it's, in, it's extremely difficult to show you what i'm trying to show you so it is what it is the, the computer is not going to do it but a person on the park there are no files on the park so so hopefully um you know it won't be as big of a problem because that's probably where you're going to use it the most anyway is on the park I don't know if my if my turbo button is stuck or something like that, and that's why they're not letting me do it. But um, we're gonna try to push Kevin Love down the court right now. All right, so we're running behind Kevin Love. So yeah, see like that. So you can just bump him out of bounds. He's trying to get it here. I'm just gonna check. Look, nobody wants to cut though, man. That's what. Okay, there you go. See, boom. It, it, it lets you do it sometimes. Like if they try to cut. It'll let you do it. Get that out of here. If, if, they, if, they, if they try to cut it, let you do it, man. But they're not letting you do it here. But like I said, just go in here. Go to controls. Left trigger about five times. Off ball defense. Familiarize yourself with these things. 
it is nearly impossible for me to show you how to do this right here. I'm sure that my real lockdowns and my day one lockdowns know how to do this. You've seen this video at least three times already, but they changed the button. This is the same, but the other two are, are you have to tap B. And so with you tapping B, you really run the risk of fouling somebody with this off ball foul. Even if you're not holding, even like, bro, even if you're not holding um, right, right trigger, you will still foul them. And like I said, I, I guess, I guess that's supposed to be like a real thing because you can't just go out there just pushing and bumping people and doing all the stuff that I used to do, just mauling people from end to end. But nobody asked for this. Like 2K, nobody asked for that. Nobody was mad that that people was was just was anybody mad? I don't know. I don't even know how this is gonna translate to the park. So that's what I was really worried about. I think that's what most people are really worried about. How is that gonna translate to the park and to the rec center and what? Heavily contested, okay. I, I, I don't know how that's gonna translate. I don't like it, but we gotta get used to it and we have to know that that file button is there. So like I said, man, y'all get there, familiarize yourself with those moves. Um, bump and chuck are probably gonna be the only ones that I'm really gonna use this year. Like I can use grab, like I can use grab, uh, all right, can I get boogie? See, like, it, I, I can't get on, I can't find the person that I would want to use it, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Bump and grab are probably the ones that I would want to use the most anyway, or chuck and grab, or just whatever, but let me see if I can do it to him. See, like, it was going to do it to him just now, so I got to be running and, and touch it. And then, see, it's going to try to foul him, so I don't know what to tell you. Okay, so he's off the ball. Like, you can't find nobody that's off the ball that actually wants to cut, man. So... I don't know, man. It's, it's impossible for me to show y'all this right here. Like I said, 2KU. I don't know why they put it on this button. It's so stupid. We had it so easy the last couple of years, and they put a button in here to file people off the ball, and it does it whether you're holding right trigger or not. Mike Wong, help me out, please. I'm not trying to foul anybody. Like I said, maybe my right trigger is just stuck and it keeps triggering it. I don't know. I don't think so because this would be happening if that were the case. But as a lockdown defender, it looks like the only thing that you're going to be able to do is use bump and chuck. I don't even know how we're going to use grab. Maybe on grab, it'll automatically do it. Maybe it'll be like it was last year with grab where it just automatically uh, does it. When you're running up the court, you can just ride people up the court. We'll check that out. And then we're gonna get up, we're gonna get up out of here. Because if you could if you can still do that when a person is running, you can engage them and then you can just keep on riding them, then that's what we're gonna have to do. But uh other than that, man, I don't know who asked for this. I understand why it's in the game. Sometimes the center might be on a guard, and if that center is on that guard, you would rather put him on the free throw line if you have fouls left, especially at the end of the game. You want to put him on the free throw line if he's got you posted too deep, rather than let him catch it and then get a get a get an automatic dunk on you. But I'm just saying, like, bro, nobody ask for this that's all that's all i'm saying anyway let me see if clay can hit some hit some clay Green! all right so let's see if i if i remember this guy right here uh up the court no nah, he just wants to he just wants to foul him let me see if i can cut the kevin love off so, i mean you can still cut people off you can still do stuff like that but but oh my god it's like the computer just just automatically passes the ball because they don't want me to play defense. You're not going to be able to practice this in here, guys. I'm just going to tell you that right now. But uh, like I said, when Thursday comes, we'll see how that goes. And uh, I'm going to holler at y'all next time, man. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Hope you learned something. At least you know that those moves are there. Familiarize yourself with them. Learn how to do them. And we're going to figure out, as soon as I figure out how to get around the fouling part, because 2KU just doesn't play properly. Nobody's trying to cut. Nobody's trying to play that, that act, well, it's, it's the, I don't know what offense they're playing, but nobody's trying to go inside. Nobody's trying to cut. So it's nearly impossible to show you that right here. But at least you have a gist of what, uh, of what I'm saying. So go, options, controls, one, two, three, four, off-ball defense. Like I said, the off-ball foul is going to be a good thing um, in some situations if you know how to use it situationally. But, uh, like, if I'm a guard and you got a center on me and, and if he's in the paint, I don't know if it'll work in the park. If it does, I'm making you check the ball up. That's going to be hella annoying if this is in the park because that's all people are going to do. A center will never score inside. They're going to make you check the ball up every single time. Please don't let this be in the park. 
That's all I'm saying, man. Stuff like that. I mean, well, it's just in the foul and they didn't depart, so maybe this won't be. But because this is a different mechanic, God, please don't let this be in the park. Anyway, I'm gone, man. You guys, you guys, um, you guys, let me know if you what you think about this. You think it's gonna be in the park? You think this is not gonna be in the park? Just like over there in the and foul, and we're gonna be able to grab people and stuff like that. And like I said, JRC and Pro Am, you got to really watch yourself. Because if you're fouling people, it's because you're hitting B. You could be trying to flop and foul somebody probably in this game. It's going to be crazy. But I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Channel. Holla! Make sure you copy some merch. The link is in the description. Leave a like on the video. And we will have that demonstration of how lockdown badges and defensive ratings work later on. I'm going to draw y'all a diagram. I'm going.